a tonic clonic is a grand mal seizure. Okay, so remember, grand mal, M-A-L. Okay, I've heard it used in the field before that if it's an elderly female, they'll say a grand mal seizure. If it's an elderly male, they'll call it a grand paul seizure. Grand mal, okay, or tonic clonic. So let's break down what this even means. So tonic and clonic. Tonic is that phase to where your body becomes tense and rigid, and clonic is the convulsion or rapid contractions of. Okay, so that's how it clicks in my head. T for tension, C for contraction. So that rapid motion, tensing up, is that tonic-clonic seizure. An absent seizure or petite mal, those go hand in hand. Okay, any more generally, tonic-clonic is the most common, and absent is the most common. All right, so with an absent or a petite mall, basically the way it clicks in my head is the lights are on, but nobody's home. They are absent in the house. So that could be that person who doesn't really appear they're unconscious, but they can just have an outward gaze. They're not having the tension, the contractions. They're just staring out, and it can be pretty brief or it can last for quite a while. Then there is focal or partial. Again, those go hand in hand. That can mean that it's generally one side or the other. Similar to a seizure, it's only really affecting one part of the brain, so it can be localized or focal to a single part of the body. Um, and it can be tonic-clonic to one part, or it could just be clonic or just tonic. Okay, but that generally is only going to affect one part of the body, but then if it does involve the whole brain, then we generally evolve into the tonic-clonic. Okay, and then we have just clonic. As we can have just the tonic, we can have just the clonic of just the complete rapid jerking motions.